Blaze fish is an absolute water. Now then, forgot to film my intro before I came out, so I'm doing it after, but um, this trip, me and Callum are fishing with worms, spinners and jigs and a few other bits and bobs. Gonna head down to the river and see what we can catch. Catch it down the road. My setup for the day is the rigged and ready fish rig, 180 semi-telescopic ultralight rod with a 3000 reel. Bit too big for the rod, but they're coming out with a 2000 reel soon. So keep an eye out for that and I'll definitely be using that for my ultralight fishing. Oh yes, Callum. Looking like a really good spot. Oh, you got a bite, bite, bite. Maybe. Might have been bobbling across the floor. Yeah. Have you? What, what is it? What on earth? That? I, I, I call it bull, bull, bull let me, let me film that. I think it's a bull knob. I've never caught one of them. Hang bull, on. Bull, bull head. So Callum has just caught this. I'm not sure what you call this. Someone let me know in the comments. Bull head. It's Callum's best guess at it. But lovely little fish. New species for me in terms of what I've even seen, so hopefully I'm going to be able to catch one. Not even got my worm on yet. Be good to catch a minnow, wouldn't it? There's loads of them. They're nibbling at it. Go on, have a go. Oh, got one. No way. Oh, no, it's off. <laughs> Can't believe it. So I've just caught a minnow that's hardly even bigger than the micro jig it was on. Quite a nice fish in terms of a minnow. Really fun catching these gonna send him on his way so we've not had anything just yet moving our way down the river well we have actually had a really small fish each Callum's using a spinner I'm using a micro jig we're pretty much in Congleton town centre now hopefully we'll be able to get something soon How are you? Unlucky. I was about to go around there as well. <laughs> <laughs> Don't need to get grab net for it. Good effort. So Callum's changed over from the, the worm to the spinner and got this nice trout from under this bridge here. Sure. I think it might have been, you well, know. I just thought, I just thought it was 
So Callum's second of the day, not, second trout. Not bad for a non-productive morning, was it? Doesn't look like I can do anything right today. <laughs> yeah? Mm-hmm. Stuck on, yeah, this is annoying. I'm getting frustrated. This fucking looks like it, yeah. Based on your look. This one's a fight. That's a big fish that staying deep. Looks like it's worth me switching to the the worm after all. What a beauty. Cool. What a fish. That's what the about average is in the There is a lot of fish here though. Hope there's a hope there's just one more Callum. I need to get one on my GoPro. Third under this bridge, definitely the biggest. Look at that for a corker of a brown trout. It's got some really beautiful markings on it. Really long fish on a worm again. Looks like the worm's outperforming the lure today, so I'm gonna make the swap over. Nice, another trout. Let me grab the net for you. Yeah. Mm. This video is just basically going to be demonstrating my ability with the net now, isn't it? It does, doesn't it? Lovely. Callum's latest fish is an absolute whopper. Look at the colours on that. Really, really long fish. Really lovely colours. This bridge just keeps providing and providing. <laughs> I need to get another weight on mine, don't I? Keeps drifting down in the current. Oh, that's a cracker. That is the biggest. Thank you. Just thread it, take your worm off, thread it through your and then move the BB in front of the way. I reckon you should get that one held up for a proper pick, you know. Yeah. 
there really can't be that many fish left in here. Oh, bite again. Three tiny little knocks. Should I just be picking my rod up as soon as I get to it when it does that, even if it's stopped by the time I get there? I'll just have a look. Bet you it's up. Some are minute bites and then some are proper bites. It just depends on which one it is. Do you know what I mean? I might bring it back in. It's probably having a fucking worm again, on it? Uh, no point fishing without bait, is there? No, it's at it again. I was so confident on my worm then as well. Right, I'm striking straight away this time. fish oh <laughs> finally it's a grayling that's not what we want to see we want to see trout really but a fish is a fish thank you Maybe it was just playing with me for ages, plucking at my... Maybe that's what it was, maybe it was a grayling. <sighs> getting you so you... The trout usually take it straight away, maybe. So, I suppose it's better than nothing, but still not ideal. Just caught an out of season grayling. Not going to keep him out of the water for long, not even going to hold him up for a photo because I want to get him out as quickly as possible. They're all me. Are they? Oh, he's Let's send him on his way. Bit of a shame to be catching an out of season grayling, but at least it wasn't just the minnow for me. Not sure where I was going wrong on those trout, but Callum was just pulling them out like nobody's business. Don't know why and I don't know how there was so many, so many big fish under that one small bridge, but there you have it. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. It really helps me out. Catch you down the road.